Hi, I'm Justin Slusser. And I'm Elisha Bendel. And we are going to talk to you today about the number one selling toy hauler fifth wheel in the entire nation. It is the Grand Design Momentum fifth wheel toy hauler. This fifth wheel behind us is loaded with top of the line features. Absolutely incredible unit. And there's no secret that there's a lot of options today on the market if you're looking for a toy hauler fifth wheel. Well, today we're gonna to give you reason after reason why you should go with the number one selling fifth wheel. So let's get started right now at the front cap. Awesome. So this unit has a one piece fiberglass front cap. The, the great thing about that is there's no seams on the front of this cap whatsoever. It's molded like a boat hull. The reason why that's important is because this area here gets a lot of stress from wind, the elements, weather, and you don't want any seams on here that are exposed to those elements because that's an area where water could potentially penetrate on, on other units that'll happen on this And this, snow. this cap is completely painted. It's an automotive paint that is just unbelievable. A lot of brands aren't gonna give you that. They're gonna give you a dyed fiberglass cap that's maybe gonna fade over time. That's not what you want. You want something that's painted that's gonna hold up over the lifetime that you own this unit. It's painted and it looks amazing. So if you get a shot of this, we were actually joking about it earlier when, it, when the unit rolled in, it kind of looks like a transformer. It's just edgy. It looks incredible. It looks high class. I can't wait to show everybody all these amazing features. Let's start right here at the pin box. This is a Moride pin box that other brands aren't going to use. And this is so important because this is what hooks into your truck. Uh, with this pin box and these dampening system that they put in place, it's gonna take a lot of that road vibration out. So when you're in your truck, you're feeling a much smoother ride. Uh, we actually get a lot of feedback from the, the transport companies that these things tow so much better with this. That's exactly what you want on your next fifth wheel. That's so true, and I can't imagine not having that, honestly. Yeah. We also can't forget about the LED lights that are built into the front cap. So you have two light strips up top. They're gonna cycle through all the colors, as you can see, and you can also choose whatever color you want. Uh, and then underneath the unit, you can actually have LED lights running underneath the entire unit, so at night, it really looks like, like a party here. Oh, you can really, yeah, identify your unit, and everyone's gonna be jealous of that. Also, another amazing feature is that all, this, all these momentums, they come pre-prepped for a side camera. Um, that's an amazing feature that when you're towing, you hit your blinker and you have a camera going down the side of your unit. It's such a great safety feature, but not everyone is doing that. You're gonna have to pay a ton of extra on other brands that just don't give you this prep. And Grand Design already takes the, the hard work out for it and makes it super simple to install it. That's a motorhome feature. Usually you only see those in motorhomes. Correct, but look at this. So this momentum is optioned with the 5500 Cummins Onan generator. Uh, this generator is capable of powering your entire unit. So you can power your ACs, um, everything that you want, you can power through this generator. It makes you self-sufficient. You can go out and literally be in the middle of nowhere and take care of your power yourself and your with your generator. That generator is awesome. Now moving on to this campsite side, I wanna talk about the storage real quick. So you actually have a drop frame construction on this fifth wheel chassis. So what that does for you is it gives you a much taller storage compartment here than you typically will find on other fifth wheels. You also have a larger entry door here. So you can bring whatever you want with you, those chairs, uh, those barbecues, whatever you wanna bring with you. And you also have upgraded components here. You have this uh, metal, handle here and they're all slam lat storage which is a really really great feature with magnetic clasps here so you don't have those cheap plastic ones that uh, always break they always, always break. fall off always break. it's terrible this momentum has six point hydraulic leveling jacks so that's going to be two more than a lot of the competition a lot of the competition is only going to give you four the momentum in this series gives you six so that's two up front two in the middle and then two in the back so your coach is so much sturdier than the competition. And that's what you want when you're walking around, you want something sturdy where the whole unit's not bouncing. And that's what you get with the six point. That's so true. Now this unit has also a four season package here. So this unit is a four season camper. You can use it in every type of weather. So they test this. It, they did, they do test it. So you actually have a fully enclosed underbelly. It's heated, you have heat pads on the tanks. And like you said, they test it from zero to 100 degrees. An independent third party tests this unit to confirm the accuracy of that. So this unit absolutely can be used in all four seasons, which is a really great feature. Yeah, it's gonna hold up to you know wherever you wanna go. You, the Grand Design Momentum is going to be able to do that for you. If you wanna travel here, there, across the US, uh, the Momentum is the coach for you. Also, you have frameless windows. So if you can pan up and look at all the windows, 
These windows are the same windows as sticking on high-end diesel motor coaches. They're not what you typically see on a unit of this size and price point. A lot of other brands are putting those framed windows in there. Those frameless windows that these are, they're high-end, they're tinted for your privacy and safety. A lot of the brands are still using those framed windows. Those framed windows, I'm from Florida. What happens with the framed windows in the sun and heat is the sun bakes those seals because uh, they're exposed to the elements and those seals eventually crack, may fall out, and that's where leaking can happen. So that's not gonna happen with the frameless windows. Incredible feature. Now moving on up, you have tons of awning space here, Justin. Tons can you of awnings. About that? So these awnings, there's one above me here and then there's one further down. Um, you could just have, with the party lighting going on underneath, with the awnings coming out, you can just have like row after row after row of patio chairs sitting out here and have this as the ultimate party machine that everyone wants to come and hang out at the Grand Design Moment. So all your friends and family can come hang out with you here underneath the awning. Underneath the awning, Incredible. underneath the shade, uh, and just kicking up, relaxing, and having a fantastic time. And those two awnings are standard. You don't have to go and add a second awning and pay extra for that second awning. Two awnings are standard with the momentum. So we can't miss this. This right here is everything. This wall is so strong. The competition doesn't do that. They're gonna give you a hung fiberglass, something that's flimsy that you can't, they're actually encouraging you to take your fist and pound it here to test the integrity of this wall. Not only that, but Grand Design gives you a three year structural warranty. Almost all other brands are gonna give you a one year. So you're gonna get three times the coverage uh, on the structure of this unit. These steps are awesome. So you actually have upgraded aluminum steps. Now these are the step above steps by Morad. I just want to demonstrate that. Can you lift that up real quick? This wow. Is a, this is an incredible thing it's because- like one finger. Yes, it's, so it's, it's zero gravity, they're gravity assisted. What's great about them too is they're not going to be springy like all those other steps. Other brands, it feels like a trampoline, not this one. This is a solid entrance to this uh, Grand Design Momentum. That's and incredible. other brands, if they don't give you this, you're going to have to spend five, $700 to get this. Just extra money they're going to have to spend. Uh, why not go ahead and do it like Grand Design? I don't understand, but Grand Design, go ahead and takes care of the customer, gives them what they want. They think of everything, even the oversized grab handle. You have to talk about that too. This oversized grab handle is incredible because if you don't have that, you actually have to get up here all the way in order to get to a handle. There's no way you can reach a handle. So you have to have this oversized grab handle, but other brands uh, won't upgrade that for you. It's something you have to do on your own and pay extra for. Correct. Now moving on back, this unit has upgraded G-range tires. So they're not gonna be the cheaper uh, E-range tires like a lot of fifth wheel brands are using. The Grand Design Momentum, they know that you need better tires in this unit to, to, for the weight of the unit and to hold everything you're gonna stick inside here. So these G-range tires have a higher speed rating, a higher weight rating. Also how they have aluminum rims, so they just look better. And then in between those wheels, you have a more ride pre-3000 suspension system. So that is the premier suspension system for a fifth wheel of this size and weight. It's going to give you better travel on that suspension. It's going to ensure that everything inside your unit doesn't get shaken up as much when you're going down the road. So when you open up your cabinets and you get to the campsite, everything's not going to be broken in the Grand Design Momentum. Yeah, they're just going to give you that extra level of protection while you're traveling down the road for everything that's important to you on the inside. So as we take a look in here, there is just endless storage that is the full width of the fifth wheel here. Uh, it gives you the capacity to put really whatever you want inside. It's a great uh, time to talk about actually the wide body construction because this unit is 101 inches wide. Typically, fifth wheels of this size are gonna be using the 96 inch wide construction. So you can, you can imagine what that does for you as far as storage is concerned, but also the interior space. You're gonna have so much more uh, cubic feet of storage and room inside with that 101 inch wide body construction. Absolutely. Let's work our way further down and open this one up. And you can see that this Momentum 376 is equipped with the outside TV, the outside skillet, and the outside refrigerator. Incredible. Like this entertainment center, this patio area is just phenomenal because it's all underneath this awning as well. So no matter if it's raining, I can still be out here and enjoy all of this. This is the ultimate entertaining, fun RV ever. Absolutely. 
Now moving on to the back of this unit, this, this unit is actually the 376 THS model number. So you have this really uh, nifty rear garage area here. You can bring your toys with you, whether it's a golf cart, whether it's a side-by-side -side motorbike. This functionality, the versatility of this floor plan of the 376 is unbelievable. So you can fit all that stuff that Elisha mentioned, but when you go inside, and I'm gonna love to show you this, that there's, you're not giving up any room inside. A lot of toy haulers, you have to give that room up, not with this floor plan. You've got a massive amount of square footage inside. And the reason why is because they have designed this garage area to when you want to put toys in here, this whole section actually raises right up with a press of a button, it's electric. So it raises up so that you have more storage here for those toys, and then when you bring those out, you lower that right back down, you have tons of room inside. I love that this garage area though is so nice and clean and finished. I mean, they've even got like residential cabinets out here. They didn't go with a cheap cabinet. They went with that high-end look still that customers are just starving for. They want that quality all throughout the unit. They don't want it just in, up front and not in the garage. You also have power in here. You have a, a duct, ducting system actually comes in here as well. So this whole garage area is climate controlled. Heat and AC. The use of this space and the versatility that it gives you is just unbelievable. Now before we get on to the off campsite side, I just want to point out a couple things back here. Uh, you actually have standard comes with this rear ladder so you can access the, the roof area for any uh, maintenance you might want to do and then it, it's actually a fold away ladder there so it stores nicely for travel. And then up top it's actually prepped with a backup camera so all the wiring is there all you have to do is uh, buy the backup camera and throw it on there. That's incredible. So moving to the off camp side, there's an amazing amount of storage here. Uh, they just keep piling on the storage. And then you've also still got your slam latch doors here. So what a wonderful feature to continue on this side. And then right here, I love that it's got this. This is your fuel station. So if you want to uh, power up your quad with fuel, your golf cart, uh, even your vehicle, you've got a backup fuel station here. You essentially have your own gas station. You do, you do. That's yeah, crazy. your own gas station, That's which awesome. is awesome. And then this is the other side of this storage. I want to show you right in here something that they do that uh, I think is an amazing feature is that all your valves are enclosed. They're already labeled for you. They're enclosed. So a lot of brands are going to take these and put them in weird spots underneath your unit. They're going to scatter them in the front, in the back, in the middle. You're going to have to go on like a scavenger hunt to find these things. Not with the grand design. They're all in one spot located easily for you to find and they're in the climate controlled area. That's incredible. Coming up to the front, there's a couple of amazing features here that Elisha's going to show you guys. So the first thing is actually the water heater. This unit is equipped with a 12 gallon gas electric quick recovery water heater. What that means for you is the whole family can take showers and not have to wait 30 minutes, 40 minutes for the water heater to heat enough water back up again and take a shower. So it's it, essentially endless water. Isn't 12 gallon like twice as big or like 40% more than a lot of the competition? It is literally twice as big. Most of the competition is still using a six gallon puny gas electric or, or even just maybe gas water heater. Right gas electric 12 gallon on this one, which is incredible. What do we got going on in here? So I love the way that Grand Design lays out their wet bay because everything that you need to access for this wet bay is actually just right in here. Uh, they also lay it out with a really great legend here so you can see how to use everything, what way these knobs have to be turned if you're gonna be dry camping or connected to city water. They make it easy for you. You also have an outside shower here, has hot and cold water, and it comes with a sprayer, so you can spray your unit off. It's almost like a mini pressure washer. I noticed that there's a water filtration system. So a lot of brands don't even offer that, but if it is prepped for one, they don't give you what you need. Grand Design is supplying the wrench, the filter, everything you need right up front to get you started and get you on your best foot camping. So as we come inside, I know you're just gonna be blown away by all the features that are in this coach. And we're gonna head right up top here to the front living room of a toy hauler. I mean, front living room of a toy hauler. That's unheard of. So not only did they do that and did it better than anyone, you've got up here two opposing sofas. So it's a great conversation piece. You can talk to each other, but there are also beds. So you can sleep however many you want. And then right over here, you've got two power recliners. So they're massaging, they're heated, they're LED lit, and they've got your little table trays. So if you want your drink, your coffee, your snack, Everything is already prepped and ready for you. This is so comfortable. And what's also great about it is it's actually Thomas Payne furniture. So this is all double stitched 
Uh, it's excellent, excellent craftsmanship here. Uh, it's plush, it feels good, it's gonna last a long time as well. So not only did they put a high quality product, but they put it in the right placement. A lot of times people don't get that part right. They can really mess up a floor plan and the flow of it, but Grand Design absolutely nailed it by putting these directly across from the entertainment center. So this area over here just looks phenomenal with your huge TV, it's a Roku TV. You've got your fireplace underneath, and beautiful backlighting and then solid wood cabinetry. So that cabinetry is not just the styles that are solid wood, but it's also a solid wood door. A lot of people don't give you a solid wood door. They're gonna give you particle board. They're gonna give you MDF. They're gonna give you something cheaper, um, but you have real wood in your house and that's what you want. And that's what Grand Design did. Talking about that, Justin, sorry to interrupt here. I just wanna point out all of the cabinetry also is, is actually hidden hinges so it's residential construction and then all the drawers have metal ball bearing drawer glides they're not using the plastic chintzy ones like most brands are using also you have upgraded uh, blackout full blackout shades it's really a great feature because it gives you that privacy at night and then also talking about these frameless windows as you can see, you can open these frameless windows. They're jealousy type windows. You can get a lot of cross ventilation in here. And you can also leave them open even when it's raining because they're that design. Now moving on up to the AC system in this roof. This is an incredible, incredible deal because the AC system is one of the quietest AC systems ever made. So this actually has full ductwork front to back. You're not gonna have spots where it's hot and spots where it's colder you're gonna have an even distribution of that cool air because of the full duct work. Yeah, they're using the racetrack ducting system. So that is a system that is catered to make your ACs more efficient. Uh, there's no sharp turns that the air has to make. So your, your ACs are gonna be uh, quieter, but they're also gonna be more efficient. And that's really what you want. You wanna be comfortable in this. And with the racetrack duct system, it's gonna be 23% more efficient than the competition. We can't forget this amazing feature. This has an electric fireplace. Elisha, like a lot of brands aren't gonna give you that. This is a huge deal because it saves you a ton of propane. It does. So you can actually use this to heat a lot of a unit uh, down to about 40 degrees. And that really is important because you, can, you don't have to use that propane, you can use that free electricity at the campground. Absolutely. Another thing about the heat is actually, when you just look at the floor, you'll notice there are no vents in the floor for the heat. Wow. Whatsoever. Where did they, like, where did they put them? They hid them in intelligent places so you have an even, even distribution of heat throughout the entire unit. But the best thing about that is because you don't have those vents in the floor, you're not gonna have those vents fill up with pet hair, dirt, uh, whatever gets swept in there. It's just kind of disgusting when those vents are on the floor and you have to pull them out and clean them. It's just something extra for you to have to take care of and clean that Grand Design has eliminated that problem for. And then underneath your duct system is a heated uh, enclosed underbelly. So this, this coach being four seasons, heated and enclosed. You've also got your heating pad, so it's gonna protect your tanks year round. So if you're in an extreme cold temperature, you can flip a switch and your heating pads heat up and take care of themselves. That's incredible. Now moving on back to the kitchen, you have features here that usually you see in million dollar homes. This faucet looks like it cost about a thousand dollars. I think it almost probably does. This is incredible, it's gorgeous. Uh, the actual countertops are solid surface. They're not using that cheap press for mica. Look how big the island is. That, it's there's huge. just miles of countertop here. You also have solid surface sink covers. They're not giving you those cheap plastic ones. And if you get a shot of the sink, this sink is huge. This is probably one of the biggest sinks I've seen in, uh, in a fifth bowl or house even. So you can it's fit incredible. your pots, your pans in this side, your plates, your cups in this side. Um, just went very well thought out. You also have this really amazing uh, office slash butler pantry. It's an incredible feature. So it's made to like have your, you wanna do office work, you wanna do homework, you wanna do school work. The chair is perfectly made to fit right there for that space. They've already provided you a workplace. Look at this too. You have a built-in bar here so that they, because you have that oversized uh, kitchen island here, you have two seats here it's gonna make a great uh, entertaining area for if you have friends over or family over. They just thought of everything in this unit. How many floor plans normally give you like at least six seating in the kitchen? I don't, it's four, I don't know it's of any four other or two, uh, especially in a toy hauler. 
That's that's very well thought out. Uh, I lo what I love about this, this dinette table uh, is that you've got the leaf here, but this table is mounted against the wall. So what that does for you is that it gives you a ton of leg room. I can slide all the way over without being interrupted underneath. A lot of the times you're going to be banging your knees, you're going to get bruises, you're going to get beat up just trying to use your unit. Not going to happen in the Grand Design Momentum. Apart from that, when you have those, those legs, you just can't fit four people here because you're, there's no room for your legs. So with this, you actually can fit four adults here like it's meant for. Other brands that have tables like this with the legs, you simply can't fit four When we go here. camping though, we like to play cards, we like to play games, board games, and we always kind of play them at this area. So I love that they've already put storage. If you can look at this chair, they've already put storage underneath your chairs. This is a perfect place for you to store your games, your cards, your decks of cards. Um, my kids love to play Uno, so I know that's where the, we'd be hiding the Uno cards. It's just very well thought out. So moving on to the rest of the kitchen, you have a really great area here. There's extra additional counter space. Uh, it's a great area to put maybe a, a Keurig, coffee maker, uh, or, ch or maybe charge devices. You have USB ports here and plugs. And then moving on up to the storage. Again, to talk about the cabinetry, it's all solid wood construction. They're using uh, you know, wood, glue, and screws. They're not just stapling together particle board like most of the industry is, sadly. You also have this beautiful uh, glass inlays here in the cabinetry. There really is just storage space everywhere. Additional down here. And then you have a massive pantry. Grand Design is known for their large pantries and they don't uh, fail here because this is one of the biggest pantries I've seen in a, especially a fifth wheel toy hauler because a lot of times all that space is, is already used up in the back. Yeah, but this, this space is, massive. is every bit as big as a real house. I mean, as a residential pantry, this is just as big. That's, that's crazy. There's even extra storage up here. So they waste no space in this unit by maximizing the storage uh, because they know that you can never get enough storage in your RV. Moving on over to the fridge, you actually have a massive four-door fridge in this unit. Uh, this unit's equipped with a gas electric uh, two-way fridge. The great thing about it is it's bigger, so you have more space to bring the food with you, but also it's a great brand. So Norco is actually uh, made in America. That's important to me. I think it's important to a lot of people. I love that it's made in the USA. Coming this way, there's even more storage up top here. Uh, glass covered cabinets, solid wood cabinet doors, the adjustable hinges, and then we've got a huge microwave here. And this is actually a convection microwave. So you've got a, basically an oven up top with a microwave. And then below, you've got another oven. And then you've got this recessed glass smooth top cover that comes back. And then these are actual like real cast iron grates that cover this up. And then you just flip this back down and you've got more workspace. So now you've got another flush, smooth countertop for you to work on. And then right here, they put in a massive, beautiful window to give you that view over here. We've got a beautiful view right now of the lake on that side. And you don't want to miss that. If you, and you will on other brands because they're not going to give you that window. So let's take, a, take another further look back here and see what we can find. Now moving on to the back of the unit, I just want to point out this is equipped with an LCI uh, touch screen system here which controls your entire unit. So you can control your slides, your awnings, your leveling system, all your lights, your tank, uh, monitoring, every single thing about this unit you can control from the screen and from an app on your phone. So this is a, a full smart RV essentially. It's like a smart home. It's an incredible feature there. Moving on to the back of the unit here, this is where the innovation of this floor plan and grand design comes into play because remember down uh, when we were outside, you had a massive garage area. This is where the bed actually lifts right up in order to fit those toys underneath when you don't need to be sleeping in here. And then it just lowers right back down and becomes a regular bedroom here. Full walk around queen bed. Doesn't look any different than in the other RV. So if I didn't know this was a toy hauler, I would never know. I mean, there's no way of knowing in, when you're inside that this is not That's a the toy hauler. Of it. A lot of times you, you give up so much uh, in the conventional toy haulers, but not in the Momentum 376. My favorite thing about this too is actually just how big these windows are. Because if you notice, it's so bright in here and usually the bedroom area is actually one of the darkest places in an RV. This bedroom area is bright, it's open, it's airy because of these massive windows. You also have a residential mattress. It's not just one of those cheap throwaway mattress. Uh, it's comfortable. It's a pillow top mattress, believe it or not. 
You can also get it in a king or a queen option in this floor plan. Uh, so you have your versatility. If you like the king, uh, you can get that. This one has the queen, but you can get the king if you like it. And then look how nice this headboard this is. This is incredible. Like residential style and then just flooded with cabinets across the top. There's just so much storage. All around. And now usually you would have, with this kind of floor plan, you'd have, you'd be left with really no wardrobe space. But you have a massive wardrobe here because they've put the wardrobe on a slide over here. So this is a pass-through bathroom. We can get to it from the bedroom or the hallway. And let's look at this huge shower. So when you step down into the shower, you literally step down into a sunken platform. What that does is give you four to five inches more of headroom height. So if you're extremely tall, you're gonna be able to fit in this shower where all the other brands, you're not gonna be able to do that. You've also got a seat right here. You've got a shelf and another shelf. So shampoo, soap, conditioner, whatever you want, it's very well thought out. There's also a very nice glass door. A lot of brands are gonna give you a curtain. They're gonna give you plastic. The Grand Design Momentum gives you a glass door. And this is actually a trifold door. So there's three panels to it to close this off for privacy. Uh, and it's very heavy duty residential uh, materials that they're using. And then they also continue it over here to the bath area. So it's a seamless countertop. And then they're also still giving you tons and tons of storage in this bathroom with these cabinets. You also have pocket doors on both entryways to the bathroom. So really, really nice built-in feature there. And then down below, if you can get a shot of this, you actually have a porcelain toilet, uh, foot flush toilet. It's not going to be that cheap plastic one like all the other brands are using. Uh, personally, I prefer porcelain toilet. Uh, I don't want to sit on a porta potty. I want to sit on a toilet. It feels like I'm in a real house. I couldn't agree more. And they're also giving you a max air fan up top. A lot of brands are giving you this little cheap fan. The Grand Design Momentum is giving you a max air fan. That's a name that's recognized across the RV industry. Uh, this fan is about five times bigger than the normal fan. It's gonna pull a lot, a lot more air out. They're just putting better quality uh, products in the Grand Design Momentum. Thanks for checking out the all new Grand Design Momentum with us. It's been so fun going through this unit and showing you all the incredible things the Momentum has to offer. Hopefully now you can see all the reasons why the Grand Design Momentum is the number one selling fifth wheel toy hauler on the market. Yeah, so if you're in the market for a fifth wheel, make sure that the Grand Design Momentum is on your list. It deserves that. So please come in, visit our stores, visit our website, call us. We make the buying process so simple. We know you're going to love camping. Uh, thank you so much and have a great day. So this actually is a gas electric quick recovery. <laughs> you have a solid footing for coming up inside your unit. These are, the rage is all about these right now and everybody loves them. <laughs> I couldn't agree more and they're also- Look at him when you say that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is the one time you can look at <laughs> Thank you for checking out the all new, <laughs> sorry. All right, this is the number one selling fifth wheel toy hauler on the market, period. <laughs> one more time.